today I'm assembling the Jumbuck outdoor patio heater. Um, should be quick, less than an hour. Okay, so I need to do a leak test first before I do anything, so I don't waste my time. So I gotta go to Bunnings to get um, a new gas tank and um, start from there. Okay, so I'm back. Just got the gas bottle from Bunnings. Now I'm ready to um, do a leak test on it. Half part water and half part liquid dishwashing soap. And uh, yes, yeah, so we just wiped it on all where they all connect and to see if we got some leaks. Let's try to open it up. So you should notice any bubbling coming out. Cool. Does it look like we have any issues? Okay. I just checked the manual now and it says that I'm supposed to be filling it with sand and then topping it up with water. So I don't want to go back to Bunnings twice in one day. So I'll just not fill it up for now. It's still easy to just fill it up later on. Yeah, just make sure that when you assemble this, this heater, make sure to buy a gas bottle and then like a, a bag of sand. I like what Bunny did with this one. They wrote the, um, the names of the bolts and the screws and everything on the back of the thing. Um, most of my, most of the things that I've assembled don't have it, so I have to like look at it this way and then figure out which one I need to poke out. So good on you, jump up. don't like the instructions of this one it feels like it miss it skips some steps and this one it seems like there's bolts here that I need to remove so I can use it to connect this thing into here but it, the, the manual doesn't say it so yeah so yeah you have to remove this uh, Like this, um, I think it would have been better if I should have connected these parts first before connecting it here, because now it's telling me to put something on the top, and it's fairly high, so I gotta, I have to use a ladder, which I do have, but it's just annoying. Like I didn't have to. With a reflector, it has a separate um, instruction manual, but um, it isn't actually very um, informative in terms of what you, sh you should do first. It just shows how where the screws should be, how it's supposed to be aligned. Um, so yeah, I guess the best way to do it is to start with the outer screws first, like make the outer rim, and then you can add the inner rim after that because like the these holes are supposed to connect to this disc so there you go i think it just makes it a lot easier whole captain america shield going on
And that's it. Um, let's finish the patio here.